All right, we are here with Lamar and Nick from the green team who played tonight. Uh, you yeah, had a... AKA the worst team in Texas. This is where we hang out at the end of every game right next to the sticker here and just think about how the night went. Just yeah. here. Just, <laughs> just yeah. meditate. Yeah. All right, uh, y'all kind of dropped a heartbreaker tonight. It was Two rough. to four. Yeah. Uh, how do you uh, think the game went? Um, it felt like we had a lot of possession. It felt like we had some good passing, some good zone control. And uh, we controlled a lot of the game. We got beat in transition a couple times, and it's just mistakes we're going to have to learn from. You know? Okay, yeah, I mean, it's early in the season. You're still getting a feel for the new uh, new draft system that y'all had. Mm -hmm. um, is there anything that uh, you saw good going with the team as opposed to last week, even though y'all did win? It's the first time y'all played together. Uh, do, do you see any of your strengths for this season so far? Uh, strengths, I would say definitely Lamar and Dan have good chemistry. Um, <laughs> they work well together. They've played a lot together. Adam is an awesome third addition to that line. Uh, if we had him tonight, it might have been a different game. But, yeah, defense just needs to uh, lock it down a little back there. I need to play a little bit better back there. And, uh, yeah, we just got to work on uh, team chemistry. I was pretty happy with how the draft turned out, so I think we have one of the one of the most well-rounded rosters, and we're also picking up Eric uh, around week six, and he will definitely strengthen our D up a little bit. Top three yeah, defensemen. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, um, I Good also. Uh, Yay! Mike's here too. Yeah. See, it is really where we hang out at the end of every yeah. game. Now it feels more natural. Yeah. There you yeah. go. Thank God, no and. Uh, <laughs> I've been talking to the other team members from uh, other teams. We all watch the games, of course. And they were telling us that you guys would be the team to watch. Do you share that opinion? Or do you think there's somebody else out there that uh, has a little bit better potential to take it all the way to the uh, Lord Danley this year? I think we're pretty solid. I think we're a top two or three contender, definitely. Uh, I mean, all the teams are pretty well-rounded. But, yeah. I disagree. I don't know if you heard, but our team name is the worst team in Texas. <laughs> so we're setting very low expectations. Um, but no, I think that tonight just shows. You know, we won 10 to 3 last week, and tonight we lost 4 to 2. Yeah. So sometimes it's all about matchups. It's about which guys show up each week and who, how you play against opponents. Sometimes it's about bounces or, you know, a hot goaltender. Some, you know, Jeff, Jeff played well tonight. Jeff played very yeah, well. They really played excellent. By no means, clearly, are we unstoppable, but I do think we have one of the stronger rosters and. You know, hopefully we'll get stronger as the season goes on and chemistry develops. Andrew, too, with the hat trick. That doesn't, yeah. Yeah. Got to stop that guy. Yeah. That yeah. Was, yeah, that was pretty impressive tonight. I did want to ask about the team name, the worst team in Texas. Mm -hmm. um, you briefly mentioned that that came from setting lower expectations. Yes. Yes. Is that a uh, more motivation or expectation? Uh, a little bit of both, I'd say. Either way, we can't go wrong, you know? I was confused by the question. There was some rhyming in there. I, <laughs> I really didn't know the rhyme. But... <coughs> Sorry. Yeah, that, that, that's a couple of people off. Uh, most people would say that would be detrimental to the team morale to be called the worst team. Do you see it that way? No, I think it, the first thing we said when we showed up today was, hey, yeah. if we lose, that's what we're expected to do. So yeah. no big deal. And definitely helps you to let the, the uh, shame roll off your back and move on to next week. <laughs> definitely the worst team in Texas. All right. Well, I thank you both for uh, the interview, yeah. and uh, we'll be looking forward to seeing you guys next week. And this has been Lamar and Nick from the worst team in Texas. Definitely.